All right, guys, what's up? Tech Help PC here with this video brought to you by TechHelpPC.com. In this video, as you can see, um, uh, I'm going to be showing you how to get customizing themes, like different themes for your uh, operating system to make it look a lot stylish and the way you want it. So, the website I'm going to be showing you is deviantart.com. I will post the link in the description and you guys can check it out. You can make an uh, account if you want, you don't have to, but if you're not gonna, um, you can just go to search and search XP themes and just click OK. If you're running XP, that is. Now, you're just gonna, you know what? I have one that's an XP theme for some reason. Um, you can uh, download these themes that they give you. So this one looks nice. The one that I liked before. I didn't download it, but it looks really nice. So if we look at a preview of it, you can see what the theme would look like. The start menu, um, the file and stuff. So yeah, um, now what you want to go is right here on the side, left side, you want to click the download button. When you click that, you want to click open with WinRAR or whatever you have. And you want to minimize that and you should get this. You want to extract the file to your desktop or wherever and close out of that. Now you have this folder on your desktop. You open it and you get this. You should get, um, depending on what you have, you should get different style of files and stuff and fonts and readme. Um, if you double click on uh, the Windows Visual Style file, you'll see this. Now, you don't want to directly uh, uh, click Apply here, because then once you restart the computer, it'll go back to the classic theme, and that's not what you want. What you want to do is go to My Computer, your C drive, your Windows, and resources and themes now this is where you want to put the file those two files so you want to just drag and drop in there and then uh, once you have it in there then you want to click on it and you want it to be uh, and then you want to click apply then you should have your theme applied and you should have it any way you want it so that's how you guys can customize your own themes and stuff. Um, there's even fonts that could be included with the theme. Looks really nice. I'm thinking of keeping this for a while. I really like it. So, so that's it for this video, guys. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. And subscribe.